So I'm Sam Trebilcock, I'm a transportation planner with Houston Engineering, and I've been a planner for about 32 years. So, you know, it's really looking at the, the long term. You're, you're looking at what the, the community's needs and what their wants are for that long term vision. You know, transportation planning is looking at all the different modes. You're not just looking at cars, you're looking at walking. Sometimes they get on a bike, maybe they have to use transit. If you're looking at the big picture, you're bringing in all the different modes. It's really important to get a, a, a better project, a, a project that everybody can use in the community, not just a few or most. I really like serving the public. That's what I've wanted to do my entire career. I got an amazing chance to do that with one city for 23 years. Now I get a chance to do it with many communities and in many different ways. Uh, hi, my name is Steve Strzok. I've been with Houston Engineering um, the past 12 years. Um, started out of college back away in 2011. I originally started out doing more geometric um, design, but for the past six or seven years, I've transitioned to traffic engineering, which for me was, was a great shift and um, yeah, love what I'm doing. Biggest motivation is really twofold. I mean, the, the first of it is, is the public that you're designing for, you know? At the end of the day, I want you to get, you know, point A to point B and get home to your loved ones. It's the same thing when I, you know, drive to work or go to the grocery store or drop my kids off. You know, we're all just looking to really, to get where we need to go at the end of the day and, and get back home. Uh, I mean, I, that should be the default, you know, in every single driving experience or every time you leave your house. And the second side of it is really just the client side. I mean, I think, Traffic engineering, my job, it, it's a service. We're providing a service to a client. It's, it's our job to provide them with a quality product that they deserve. And at the end of the day, I want them to look back and be like, okay, it was, it was a pleasure working with you know, Houston Engineering or Steve on this. It should be a seamless process. And you know the early stages, for the most part, are planning but you're always bringing in traffic engineering in that early stages too, because you might miss something if you don't. And on the same token, you know, traffic engineering should be bringing in planning at the later stages, otherwise they might miss something. It's, it's all about making you know, the most complete street that you can. It's really the team members putting their input where it needs to be and put at the right time. Um, I mean, that's, that's how you make successful project. I mean, it's that collaboration, it's that coordination um, from get to point A to B, you know, it, it's the original conception to the construction. Um, you know, having those voices along the way really helps, you know, speed up the process, but yet it helps to kind of avoid those large mistakes. 